Hey there, this is Pankuri and you're watching Movie Talkies and today I'm going to review our bulkies much talked about Kareena Kapoor, Arjun Kapoor starer Kiyan Ka. But why did he name it Kiyan Ka? He could have simply called it Abhiman Reloaded. Why I'm saying so? Well, watch the review to find out. Karina's character Kia is a corporate robo just ka dream hai apni company ka CEO banna. Arjun's character Kabir on the other hand is a B-school topper jise apne famous realtor dad jaisa nahi apni housewife mom jaisa banna hai. The duo meet each other on a Chandigarh Delhi flight, sparks fly, love blossoms aur ye tay karne ke baad ki after marriage Kia will go to office and Kabir will manage the house, they tie the knot, much to Kia's mom's amusement and Kabir's dad's disappointment, who even asks him to do a chaddi check because dude, mard ghar nahi sambhalte. As Kia climbs up the corporate ladder, Kabir turns their house into a railway museum and dishes out delicious delicacies for his sasuma and his wife. अपने अनकन्वेंशनल जॉब की वजह से वो काफी पॉपुलर भी बन जाते हैं। He becomes the poster boy for housewives, torch bearer of feminism, and a social media star. However, things become ugly between the couple when Kia starts getting jealous and insecure of Kabir's rising popularity. Film for Amitabh Bachchan, Jaya Bachchan starer Abhiman wala track pakar leti hai and what happens next forms the rest of the plot. Film ka sabse bada problem ye hai ki while trying to break gender stereotypes, it actually ends up reinforcing them. Balki ji, hume ek baar mein samaj a gaya ki Ka is the house husband and Ki is the breadwinner. You did not need to thrust it down our throats with incessant lectures on the same. The film's concept thrilled me no end, but its weak plot and shoddy execution made me disappointed. disappoint Kia. Kabir and Kia meet in a flight mein milte hai, jahan Kabir is crying in the morning. A woman as strong as Kia would run miles away from a guy like this. लेकिन की और का दोनों उसके बाद सीधे पब में पार्टी करने चले जाते हैं। जब कबीर किया को एक रेस्टोरेंट में बताता है कि वो अपनी हाउसवाइफ मॉम जैसा बनना चाहता है, she makes a snide comment about it which angers him और वो सब के सामने उस पर चिल्लाकर चला जाता है। Why would a woman tolerate such a behavior from a man जिससे उसका कोई लेना देना नहीं है and on top of that apologize to him for days? ऑडियंसेस के दिमाग में एक ही बात चलती है क्योंकि वो एक अमीर बाप का बेटा है गरीब होता तो शी वुडंट हैव केयर अ डैम शादी के बाद इंस्टेड ऑफ किया कबीर डिसाइड्स टू वेयर हिज मॉम्स मंगल सूत्र वाज इट रियली नीडेड मंगल सूत्र पहनाया है तो मां की साड़ियां भी रही होंगी वो भी पहना देते बल्कि जी पूरी फिल्म में आपको करीना घर से बोर्डरूम और बोर्डरूम से घर जाते हुए दिखेंगी, while her husband is seen cooking dishes. Throughout the film, लोग खाते पीते रहते हैं और जो बचा खुचा स्पेस है, उसमें थोड़ी सी स्टोरी है। फिल्म में इतने प्रोडक्ट्स की ब्रांडिंग है कि आपको लगेगा कि आप एक दो घंटे की एड फिल्म देख रहे हैं। Now that you know that, you know what to expect from Ki and Ka. Let's talk about acting. Kareena Kapoor Khan is not only looking pretty, but she is also given a fab performance. Her Kia is strong, independent and confident and she has done full justice to her role. Sadly, we can't say the same about Arjun who has sleepwalked through the film and is looking rather lethargic. Their jodi is refreshing but it lacks chemistry. They have a lot of intimate scenes but despite that, they have failed to set the screens ablaze. Swaroop Sampath ne Kia ki maa ka role nibhaya hai and she has done a fantastic job. Rajit Kapoor is playing Kabir's father in the film aur aap unki acting definitely enjoy karenge. Amitabh Bachchan and Jaya Bachchan also have a cameo appearance in the film and it won't be wrong to say 
that their presence and endearing chemistry is the film's only saving grace. After watching the trailer, I had very high expectations from this film, but after seeing the movie, I can't believe that a genius like Balki has come up with such a frivolous fare. Film ka screenplay bohat vahiyat hai and the dialogues will make you cringe as they are very cliched aur unki wajay se ki aur ka ke characters bhi kaafi caricaturish lagte hai. Mujhe nahi lagta ki high heels ke alawa film ka koi bhi gana hai jo aapko theater se bahar nikalne ke baad yaad rahe ka. I will give Ki and Ka one and a half star. Go and watch this film if you've got nothing better to do this weekend. So that's all we have for you this time. I'll catch you next weekend with something new and something fresh. Till then, stay tuned to Movie Talkies and do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.